welcome today we we'll learn factless fact table so what is a fact we have already seen already seen so facts are related to the majors like we can calculate the sum we can calculate the aggregate functions like max mean so the what will be the factless fact table the factless the meaning indicates it is without fact but the fact table is important for its facts but as it is missing fact it is called factless fact table fact table connected to the number of dimension tables usually we have a single fact table in the schema so we are study the star schema snowflake schema and fact constellation schema these are the three types of schema so the fact table contains the keys and it also contains the majors the fact table contains the keys to the dimension tables the primary keys of the dimension tables are included in the fact table as foreign keys the fact table contain facts fact consists of numeric as well as additive fields so a fact list fact table is a fact table that does not have any major or that does not have any fact so we can call it is an intersection of simply the dimensions as there are no facts let's see the example here we have the dimension tables student subject and class we can define the dimension student with the fields roll number student name student address etc another dimension is subject so which subject a student opt english maths science so these are the subject core subject name and we may say the subject teacher as the fields of subject dimension similarly the class dimension it may have the fields class core class name and the class teacher all these three dimensions are connected to a central fact table the primary key of student is roll number primary key of subject is subject code and the primary key of class is class code so the fact table contains the all of these keys as a foreign keys and there is no other field except these keys in the fact table so this fact table is without facts so what is the important of factless fact table sometimes it is possible to fetch the data without the facts or without the majors for example we can calculate the number of students in a class without using any fact so such when there is a requirement we can calculate or we can fetch the data without any fact or majors in that case the fact like tables factless tables can be used so the factless fact tables offers a very most flexibility in the data warehouse factless fact table does not make sense as 
it does not contain any facts but in there are many situations where it gives makes a sense in data warehousing the example we are seeing just now so in summarizing a factless fact table is a fact table without a fact it consists of dimension keys only so the calculation part is missing or not available in the factless fact table the factless fact table shows only relationship with dimension tables but does not contain any major or numeric or textual fact so such kind of factless fact tables are usually helpful in case of the tracking system for example student attendance tracking system another example is identify identifying a location for the covid-19 hospital so in this case the infrastructure the location and the hospitality available can be monitored or can be analyzed to decide whether the covid-19 hospital can be built or not so this type of analysis does not require any fact or does not require any major it's a simple analysis of fetching the data based upon a query so for such type of tracking systems the factless fact table is useful so it is used for tracking a process it is used for collecting the statistics there are two types of event or that can be handled with the factless fact tables those describing the events keeping the track of employee leaves so here we can keep the track of employee leaves how many leaves the employee have taken when he has taken the leave or the remaining leaves or from the total leaves so such kind is called describing the events and the second type is those describe conditions so we we may put on some conditions while fetching the data we can calculate the whether the product is having very less sale or there is no sale and we can relate the selling of the product with the promotions whether the product is promoted and sale mostly sale sold the product is without promotion and not sold the product is without promotion and having more sale so like this we can put the conditions and we can analyze the data without majors so this is how in today's lecture we have seen the factless fact table and its importance where to use it thank you